you know, this might be a good place to talk about um, a new procedure. It's a robotic procedure mm -hmm. actually being done here mm -hmm. in Spokane. And Dr. Peterson, who has been a guest on this program, is uh, starting to practice this procedure. I want to take a look at uh, some of the, the video of him actually doing this. It's for a partial knee replacement. Correct. And, and Dr. Montine, you were actually in the room when he was uh, practicing this robotic procedure. I was. So here is he's starting to shave the um, condyle to get it ready for the prosthesis. Because we do see a lot of patients that will need this procedure. Correct. And um, he's very impressed with the results. Um, and he's, um, he's been doing it now at Providence. And what are the advantages to doing it this way than the traditional knee replacement with the robotics? Um, so he would be a, a better person to, to go into this. Mm -hmm. But from his perspective, it seems that uh, once you get trained, the, the robot does the work and it does it right every time. So uh, as an orthopedic surgeon, it seems like you have to do a lot of procedures in order to get your hand and be really good at this at the partial replacement. Is this you only have to get trained uh, on how to use the robot and then you would be able to, to do it right every time. Okay, and Dr. Peterson actually explains a little bit more about the procedure that he's practicing in this video. I think if you're a candidate for a partial knee replacement, which is a small percentage of patients, maybe 10% of all the patients that are gonna have a knee replacement are candidates for this. But if you have this replacement, then you save both ligaments, your anterior cruciate, your posterior cruciate, and you save your kneecap and the joint, the patellofemoral joint, and you save your lateral joint and the meniscus. So all you lose is the diseased part of your joint you're realigned and balanced, so you have a much better function than a total knee replacement. That's amazing, and probably a lot less invasive, so your recovery time is going to be a lot quicker exactly. than in traditional methods. That's yeah. pretty neat, pretty neat to see those kind of you know, advancements being made for quality of life, essentially, then. And, and because we have an aging population, we're gonna probably see more of that. Correct.